This could be dangerous. Yep, Mr. Ravine. Oh, it's right here. Nice. Then along corridor is a familiar sight. A forest choked with a thick fog that limits visibility. You remember how easy it is to lose your way here. You find yourself in the misty ravine. It is becoming evident that the four labyrinths are connected underground. You would not be surprised to find that the lush woodlands were, were also connected. You resume your search. Oh, okay. I was wondering if that was going to happen immediate or not. That means that the door thingy should be right there, too. Yeah, so, oh, right, yeah, this means that we're going to have to deal with um, those things, yeah. Now we got a big shortcut door. Yeah, we're going to have to deal with one of these, I guess. I want to get this door. I might be able to get back here much more easily. Hello. Oh, she aggro's on me. Wow, how rude. So I can't just sneak past like that? Aw, but I was banking on that. You know, just making sure I did manage, to, you know, no. Guess what I forgot to buy again. Shit. Ah, <laughs> uh, that's. Hmm. I am slightly tempted to see if I can get past her. I probably can't. Like, if I move up, she'll probably just. Well, she'll probably move up. That's a good option. It's a good opportunity to actually check that. Wait, no, she's gonna turn around. She might not actually attack me. She might just be. She might just get aggressive just so I can't get back attacks on her. Thank you. Okay, good. We can just leave this way. Uh, what's the fastest route out of here again? Oh man, now I have to deal with the numbers again. Because these are going to be now new paths. Shit, why? Okay, um, anyways, uh, six I think was the fastest. Because I think you just had to go that way, didn't you? Wait, no, six just takes you over there. Which will take you to five. Seven's the fastest way out, and it's getting to six. Okay. Because I know I can handle the ra the enemies here without much of any issues. I can just auto-attack these things. Oh, right. I was, wonder I was about to say, there's no path there. Why are you attacking me? Yeah, let's just escape instead. I got the preemptive already. He says I don't have to go through the annoyance of having to clear my inventory. All right, I started using those, didn't I? Huh. Wait, where's the fastest route out of this place? Um, I think it's six, isn't it? Six is six is there, which goes yes yeah, six. So six should go right there. Let me just go straight up. I get attacked right in front of the door. Hello. Oh, I got a new drop. Go, cr go figure.
Hello, Petaloid. Does that count for your... No, maybe not. I think that was Olga, wasn't it? Yep. Okay, Squall Volley's maxed out. Silver Arrow would be another good one, aside from increasing your crit. Which I think I was planning on doing. Hit rates, drop rates, crit, increases your crit rate, and then bullseye to increase it in general. It's like either that or I put more points to Silver Arrow. So I guess we'll go with that for right now. Yay. Uh, first things first. There. <laughs> that way I don't forget again. Okay, uh, what are we looking at for stuff I just unlocked? Half armor, which is for your defense, which nobody can really make good use of. Never mind, nobody cares. How oh, nice. Wait, 40. Oh! Pff. I was about to say, what? 40? Yeah, right. It was because I just unlocked that. Rune gauges. Ooh, double the tech, you say? Um. It's better than the hairpin, I guess? Wait, no. Oh, no. I guess. Wait, he still has the hairpin. Jeez, I forgot about that. Isn't there. Wasn't there a hat that gave better, like, circle? It? Oh, right. Yeah, uh, that's Stone Shell, which was from some FOE or something. Accessories, I didn't lock anything. Weapons! Warbow, 124. That's probably worse than what she has. Hers is that one. Higher damage, but I think the 3 crit is be makes it slightly better. Basilard, um... It's a dagger. Nobody cares. <laughs> Let's see. This dagger, on the other hand, is quite nice. Four slots for status ailments, or element up, or something like that, because daggers have a plus three to speed. This would be just as good if I don't give a shit. <laughs> I'm mostly just trying to think of what to give to Xiao, since I was going to go stats. It's basically, same thing I'm going with Juliana, that way he has something to do, considering the builds I was going with the characters. Okay, so, um, if we're going with that... Maybe I should actually... Oh, right, he has a katana that I'm not using. He has an imperial blade that I'm not using. Why didn't I even think about that? I'm not using those guys. And Adric could very well use their shit. I mean, three of them are classes that I'm not using. <laughs> kind of. Sort of. Plus, these things are expensive as fuck. And plus, I was going for this one anyways because of the way I'm building Adric anyways. I should have thought about that. Jeez. Oh, okay, maybe not that. You can have that. The armor, on the other hand, he can ditch. Because Adric's not using... Oh, wait, no. Adric would probably be using a shield, because it's a two-handed weapon. He can't use two weapons. Weapons to go along with that. Uh, this... I do have someone who's using a mace, so, yeah. A little strength, sure. I'm sure someone could probably make good use of that. I was specifically not using that. I'll just look at that for right now. Okay, anyways, oh, right, um, equipment. Adric. Real blade, there we go. Now I can actually use his damn skills. Good for 
now until I give them something better. Reika. Uh, I think she can still use her skills with Katana. Well, she's still going to be using this one anyways. I'm just mostly trying to think of what... Let's see. Uh, this one's 122. This one is 103. Okay, never mind. Because she has Katana skills too. Says that, which, yeah, that's burst. I should have realized that. It f speeds up burst. You're really using de dual wielding daggers specifically just to get stuff to go with that. Hmm. Wait a second. Oh. One, okay, 122. Yeah, I, I think that's actually better. Potentially. And you. I need to see, because he's, yeah, he's Night Seeker, because I'm taking advantage of ailment bursting. That's how I've had him, have him built. Specifically around those, that one skill that uh, deals more damage when something's inflicted by ailments, which is what Zhao is basically focused more on, binds and ailments. She has heals, but also using her physical shit that I'm not using. Specifically that uh, star drop, so I can... Increase the damage that an enemy takes for the rest of the turn. Reika is just full blown damage with Bushi. And Adric is taking full advantage of elemental weakness. That's how I have them built, anyways. But as you can see, I need to get them a little leveled up to catch up to the party in order to do anything. Alright, so I should be in a new stram, so yes! Over the a description of a new kind of mark, use this to find out what it is and report back. Let me guess, it's the one I just saw. You have come, as I surmised, you, the request comes from the outline count. He has a new mark for you to find. New document provides clues to this location. Go on, hurry, and see the outline count. Eagerly await your swift return uh, and the tale that follows. Our over reliance on his Imperial Highness may be one of the reasons the Empire spiraled out of control. That's why we Imperial Knights must be the ones to stop him. In that way, I remain loyal to my Empire. I'm sorry I have. I have that you have been tangled up to this, but I need your help, Karhani Guild. Track me down, of course, the eggs are so withered, I cannot uh, stay upset while running my bar. This establishment is where those who are distraught uh, by the certain events come to find solace, after all. If you ever feel the need to talk, feel free to visit. I'll lend a welcoming ear. First off, sell the junk that I'm not using. Oh, uh... I don't see myself ever using that, to be honest. That one, maybe. Show on. Maybe not. That one, maybe. I don't know. I haven't decided yet. No. Oh man, you gotta hear this. That dry blade the Imperial mooks brought in is something else. It, uh, uh, put, uh, Put your condensed spell for the end of the catalyst and trigger the chamber ignites for the drive. Pretty sweet, ain't it? Maybe you could start using them too. It's supposed to be. A d oh, right, that. That thing. Oh. Well, it doesn't. Ow! Morning's fine. Oh, hey, Wufan. So, Guild Kurohana, you've returned to the city. You run to Ufan, the vessel Arcanist in the city square. She looks rather pale. Huh, I haven't slept well. I knew that from the hollow incident already, but my own weakness still disgusts me. I know what causes it. I can't stop worrying about the medium. There's only so much I can do alone can do. Ufan ca casts her gaze down and clutches her staff between her slender fingers. I'm sorry for wasting your time with this. You're going, no. Try not to do anything rash. She forced a smile before parting with you. The Imperial Knights, they're very interesting fellows. Their fighting style is based around the drive blade. It's very unusual, but I suggest you ask them about it. Okay. 
Who thought you can get all the way to the Mystery Ravine from the Forgotten Capital? Seems like all the big labyrinths are connected. And since the Forgotten Capital is under Eggsil's roots, you've been inside Eggsil from the beginning. Alright, you accepted again. Then I'm safe from the bother of an explanation. We found yet another Imperial document. Pay attention to the. Well, I'll read this one aloud. It's mentioned there are two starting points. A1 and. We have successfully. Uh, two starting points in A1. We have successfully excavated codename Trigger. Uh, let me get my thing up. A1. Two. Two points. If you enter the starting point with codename Gatekeeper simultaneously, it should guide you to the reaction. As long as short of it. Before I had no idea how to solve this, but this changes things. Perhaps the mark mentioned here is like the water and fire marks we discovered. If that's the case, but you know where I'm going with this by now. I want you to get the mark in this document to react and report the location to me. Two points in A1. That's what it said, right? Anyone's way at the top corner. I don't think I've actually been there. Yeah, A1's kind of cut off, isn't it? Oh, I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> oh, well, I'm looking at stuff. Maybe I can get one of the birds that actually helps out and Dallas table won't break again. Golden quail. Yes, yeah, tech. That should work. I imagine. Probably. Because none of the other food around here does it. Let's see. Oh. So, let's see. A1. So, we are technically in A1 right now. So there's either a hole down there, or there's something else I'm supposed to do. Okay. I mean, I don't feel like fighting this thing, so... I'm just gonna be lazy and try to... Oh. oh. You thoroughly sur survey the area, and suddenly... Uh, ch chance upon a small Imperial flag just below your skyship. Oh, okay. Oh, I get it. Or not. Okay. We need this thing to simultaneously, so we need this X. We it looks, sounds like we need to use the FOE as well. So is it inside of there? It doesn't look like I can actually... Because... This is the outskirts of A1. Wait, oh, this is still A1. Oh. I mean, it just step, happened to step in that spot at the exact same time. Nice. All of a sudden you hear a strange, familiar sound from the east. Something has happened. So let's play the area of... Small flag. Wow, that, that was that was a massive coincidence. <laughs> on the east, okay. So probably on one of these things. As you hunt for the origin, you find Panko rising from the stone pavement. This would be its source. Boom. Mark of the engraving symbolizes the earth. This must be the spot. Copy down its location report to the count. All right then. Mm. 
Alright, did you get the mark? Yeah. That's because that's for my favorite explorers now than where we find it. Um. Alright. You have to withdraw the com compliment I gave you. Oh no. There seems to be no mark. It was right here. Damn it. This result is unacceptable. I'm left with nothing but the awkward praise I gave you. Be careful information next time they make the mark. Yes. I did. I just marked the. I just gave you one of the older spots. Because of it. Uh, there's. I guess that's all four of them, isn't it? It's right here. Congratulations, my friends, you've done it. The scouts found the mark just where you said it would be. Reports that, yeah, that given its shape, it appears to be the Earth mark. That's three so far. Oh, so we found three. So don't know what they're for. Perhaps we'll never know. But that's all part of the research process. Now, now, my friends, the request is complete. Go to the bar. Also, we'll do this, too, at the same time. Welcome back. Did you catch something that makes someone smart? Golden Quail? Sure about this? Go prepare something. You were right, spot on. He was very satisfied. I knew it was right to believe you. But then, craziest man. I want to eat a death mantis's favorite food. Death mantis's favorite food? Oh, is it fish? Considering how it guards that fish over there. Death Mantis. Or maybe not, I don't know. I mean, I killed it, so I have no way of actually telling what its favorite food is at the moment. Alright, I forgot to put that back. Wrong button. Very good work. Once again, you easily fulfill the appointed task. Was it the Earth mark this time? Water, fire, Earth. Three marks so far. Does it also seem to you that another request will be posted soon? I simply have a feeling. At any rate, here's the reward you were promised. Them, throws maxed out. Yay. Next up is this. Yeah, this is the skill that I gave um, Yaksha. Won't do quite as much damage without this, but it's still good shit. Count since I can actually talk to him without it being quested. I believe the main labyrinths in the Exorcist are connected by subterranean passages. They originally one maze, but for whatever reason, the passages were sealed, leading to what we now know. Perhaps the people of old thought to seal away Exorcist's power by closing off the individual areas. Let's see. Um, I don't think there's another quest. It'll probably be when I get. Yep, when I get the next area. Makes sense. Makes perfect sense. One second. Okay. Save again. That way I don't have to do quest again. Okay, moving on. We can just go back to the second stratum and be perfectly fine.
I was gonna say, I didn't have that from before. That's nice, I suppose. Gonna sneak right past you. Okay, here we go. Moving back on to where we were before. Yes. Uh, no shortcut spots over here. It seems. Oh no. Oh, I don't like the looks of that. Evil root. Oh no. Aren't those the? Hollow hoplite. Okay, so when that thing dies, it sleeps. Okay, I was afraid it was going to do, like, uh, that it had an instant death attack. You know, something scary like that. Oh, wait, no. Oh, only two people need healing. There we go. Much better. I was a little wary about them, like, popping in and just going, like, instant death, like, you know, at Trinity 2. I was a little more fearful of them, but I guess they're not that big of a deal. As long as I kill them second. Okay, so there's a spot right there. Oh boy, Misty. There's a shiny on the other side of this one. I'm gonna mark it. There's definitely something on the other side of that one, too. I need to pay very close attention to this stuff. So there's a path this way. Oh, no. Let's go this way first. Uh huh. I thought I saw some flowers right here. Thought so. Okay, this is a shortcut for getting back here. Probably to get cl get close to the end. Okay, okay. I'm out of the misty part. special over here? Not even for a dead end event or something? Okay. Yeah, you guys again, plus uh, that rabbit back there. Thunder here, okay. That 
seems like a dick. It's lightning, so... It's either weak to fire or ice. Isaac, uh, good question. What do we put you in for? All right, I, all right, yeah, I was, uh, oh, he already got that. Never mind. Um, this I don't really care about because I'm not really focusing on his ailment stuff. This doesn't really ma matter. Sleep could be useful, even though I'm focusing Shao on that type of stuff. Let's give them that. Because that could be very helpful for Rhiannon. And old guy, I suppose, too. I could probably kill it, but I'm going to at least try not to. Just because. I don't have a real reason for not doing so. Oh, you're you're new. You're an ice version of those assholes. Oof, there's those fucking butterflies back there too. Mm. Ice bolt, yep. Okay, so it does affect all of them. Was I blind? Probably. And by that, that means this is going to take me somewhere. Boom. Okay. Uh, what numbers have we used? I think we've used all the way up to nine, haven't we? Yep. Oh, we did that on the previous floor, so let's start with um, starting from the top. To make thing to keep things more con uh, consistent. Oh no. something over there. Oh, it's a MOA. Okay.
As you walk in the mystery forest, this, this thick scent of plants in your nose, you see a vessel at a dead end. The vessel turns its head toward you. It's hard to believe a vessel would have business in this place. You're afraid to ask why he's here. You walk towards the vessel intending to speak to him, but you shudder as you look into his eyes. His cloudy eyes have no life in them. He is already dead. Before you recover from your shock, the poor corpse falls over and a monster's attack from behind it. Oh no. Oh yeah, we learned what they their way to oil elements, gotcha. Oh, okay. They're dead. I, I, I mean, I'm gonna try to do some damage to them anyway, just in case Phantom Sword doesn't go off, but, um... They're possibly dead. Oh, hey, the one person! to endure the hollow's ambush and emerge victorious. Seems the monsters have been animating the vessel's corpse uh, to use as bait for unwary explorers. You silently pray for the unlucky vessel's soul and vow to avenge his death as you walk away. Oops. Unknown metal mining point. K K K. Let's see, see, see. Hmm. Why did I get attacked, like, right when that happened? Why, game? Why? Why would you do this to me? Aw, oh, man. I was trying to lure it away! Aha, that's the trick. Well, I already caught on to how this trick works anyway, so whatever. I'm supposed to lure it up there, and then I go uh, this way. Or I just kill it. Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> I'm not a fan of this one. One lived!
What? That doesn't work. Because it immediately spots me when I get back into the room. <laughs> hmm. So, I legitimately have to kill it if I wanted to go that way. Okay, so let's not go that way right now. I'll just be stubborn about it. Okay, well, let's lure this one over here instead. Because it looks like there's probably a door somewhere down here where it currently is. And all we have to do is just step right here. Boom. Follow me. Oh, man, the game really loves this encounter, doesn't it? Man. Oh, no! Okay, at least my good threes are good. At least. Ah, man, stop getting me into encounters. I don't want to fight. Okay, this is a little better. Okay, uh, you are risen to lightning like we pretty much already established. Okay, um... Uh, um... we to uh, anything, so we'll just use lightning, why not? You... Sam, throw that asshole back there. Um... You just nuked this lady. Uh, head bind him and nerf. Yeah, because I don't want his silly lightning chip getting off my party. Next one. Nope. Totally this one. Uh -huh, I, go f I had a feeling that there was something sneaky about this. I would have to lure it back there anyways. Huh, really? It doesn't go this far? I was about to say, it better not attack me, like, right there. I would have been kind of pissed. Wait, there's a door right here? Oh! This now makes f so much more sense. Goes to show what happens when I don't pay attention. Ah, as per usual. Okay. 
Okay, uh, let's see. Um, doesn't really matter what I hit you with. Um, try to blind you. No. Just in case it doesn't go through. And we can arm snipe you. And we'll line heal the top row. I don't think I have a lot of thunder too. No, I don't. I have a lot of butterfly wings, so. That's opened or whatever. I shouldn't mark it like that unless I know for a certain. Okay, I thought so. Enter the path, you find a worn hand cover book, hardcover book. Most of the pages are now unreadable, but you can make out the following Egdrasil Sealing Project Summary 3. The way to Egdrasil's core is sealed. The foreman must approve of any release. The facility's entrance is connected to the tablets. Once the tablet seals off, consult pr for approval. More than that is impossible to read. You leave the book behind and hurry on ahead. Hmm. Decisions. Kind of funny that that actually leads to a point, to a gather point, anyways. But you know, that's a mining point, and I can't actually mine from it because I'm full on in inventory. Curses! And this, I get rid of all those butterfly wings that I don't want. Oh wow, I have a lot of those, don't I? Curses! Yeah, let's get rid of some of them because I have a lot of them now. Oh, that's helpful. For sure, everything that I can unlock with these are better. Okay, I'm trying to find it, get it, at least another shortcut so I can get back to this area a lot faster. Nah, 
Yeah, I know. Thank you, Juliana. That that random that 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 formation did not. Nope. That's annoying. <laughs> Why would you do this? Oh. You know what? Let's just double that up to make it seem a little more obvious. I said I unlocked a shortcut. Oh, that leads somewhere too. Red throw, you say? I until use it up. at least to there. Hi. I can at least see to there. Are 
kidding? Um, there we go. Okay, you, 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 you. Right, uh, power boost. Okay, can't remember if anybody else leveled up recently. I just forgot to level them up. Find a small money man that's dead end stopped. Close inspection reveals a message engraved on it. Decipher our travelers by thy name is Water. What does this mean? one of those in other stratums too considering how I've seen two of them so far though there might be one back in the fourth one I'd have to actually look around for it okay okay let's see uh, go back to where we were we need to lure that guy up there somewhere else all right so that takes me up there Do that again because it looks like it's gonna pull that shit on me once more. Now I can keep track of it better. How rude. Okay, okay. Hmm. So let's see. Okay, we need to go through that door. Gotcha. The door was held way earlier. I might. I, oh, I guess I accidentally solved the puzzle already. Cause I just straight up ignored this door <laughs> for no reason. I guess I just wanted to go to the lower one first. I don't know. It happens. Curses! I must get rid of something. Something, uh, Dragonfly Nester. Fairy boots. Boots, huh? High agility, okay. Defense and super high agility. Who's using those that could actually make good use of high agility? Him. He'd lose some T ooh, he'd lose a decent amount of TP, but being super fast to get those heals out faster could prove to be a little more useful. <sighs> oh, it's red throw. He has to put full rune so that the thing doesn't the thing up in the front doesn't straight up murder my party. Of course.
things. Oh, it's because I can't... It's because I'm, like, just right out of range, that's what. So I did actually have to lure it over here. I really don't want to fight you guys right now, I'm busy. past this point. Hmm. And that's definitely the way forward. Of course it is. <sighs> Let's go all the way back over there. Granted, I know the way back easily. We just go to these red ones. They both lead to the same place anyway. Nope! This is bad, this is bad, this is bad. Thanks, Isaac. Ah, oh, shit. Are you fucking kidding me? Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> 